to Truly Maddie Weekly and today I'm here with Rufus who's been a bit poorly. I had to take him to the vet earlier because he, I thought he had a URI, an upper respiratory infection. As you know guinea pigs are prey creatures and they can go downhill really quickly. So I whisked him to the vet because I noticed that he was um, making a popping and crackling sound with his chest. But um, the vet didn't seem to think he didn't he couldn't actually hear anything on his chest but just in case he develops it becomes a bit more in the next couple of days he has given us some medication for him some anti-inflammatories and antibiotics but he says that obviously if he's fine in the next couple of days don't give them to him because obviously we don't want him to get resistant to antibiotics because that wouldn't be very good for Rufus but I noticed that obviously he was still behaving as normal he was still eating and drinking etc he was still running around with nutmeg but i just noticed that he was making this sound and it always worries me that sound because it's it's a very specific sound it, it's it's like a struggling for breath kind of sound it's it's a popping a crackling guinea pigs make varying different sounds throughout the day but to get to know your guinea pig really well you will be able to discover what is that what what is what sounds are good and what sounds are bad and obviously i knew that that sound that i was hearing from him wasn't a good sound so took him straight to the vets uh vet was quite happy that he couldn't hear anything at the time um but he like I say he has given the medication just in case i always advise owners you know if they're ever concerned about their pet um you know get them to the vet straight away any kind of abnormal behavior particularly weight loss which is why we should weigh our guinea pigs weekly which is why i weigh my guinea pigs weekly because that's often one of the first signs rufus hasn't lost weight though so that doesn't always work which is why it's just really important to get to know your guinea pig get to know um like the different behavior traits it makes it so much easier to catch things quickly rather than letting things go on and then there not being a lot you can do if you discover it too late. So yeah, so I thought I'd just give you a little update on Rufus. He is quite susceptible to URIs. Um, the other three guinea pigs don't have never got URIs, upper respiratory infections, but he has always seemed to be more susceptible to them. Him and his brother Rory. Please like, share and subscribe. Thank you very much.